Hello, hello everyone. So welcome to the video. Today we are actually going to review the GPT 4.0. This is amazing launch by OpenAI and this is guys amazing. R literally, uh, like this blew my mind. And uh, let's see what is uh, in it. So we'll be asking some questions from this uh, model and we'll be seeing that how uh, good this is and be till the end because there is one important trick I am going to show you at the end of this video. So be till the end and let's start this video. So uh, this is the chat GPT uh, uh, 4.0. So uh, like uh, if you haven't get uh, the uh, this then you will be uh, actually getting it uh, in uh, upcoming weeks and uh, I have actually got it. So first uh, thing is that it have the feature to upload the PDF. You can see here, just let's upload the PDF. Okay, I have the 0 to 1 PDF. Let's see, uh, yeah, it will uh, work or not. Okay, now give me, give me the summary. Summary of, give me the summary of um, each chapter. So let's see how it is going to um, give the information. So it is actually reading the document, uh, documents, guys. Let's see. Wow, amazing. So it is it is actually giving us the, um, the giving us the ideas and the uh, all the things uh, chapter wise. You can see here it is giving in the uh, point form. Okay, maybe uh, this will be not the format uh, that you will get in your GPT uh, because I have used some trick that will uh, that I will tell you at the end. Okay, so this was really amazing. You can see how clear how with a very clear concept, it is giving the answers. So that is amazing guys. You can see here and you can literally uh, tell it to do more things. Okay. So now I have some questions, uh, uh, some creative questions to ask from this uh, chat GPT. So uh, this is like, uh, because you know, like it's, uh, it's, it's cutoff date is uh, I think in 2023. So we'll be not asking it uh, daily life questions, but let's ask about the philosophy question that um, what is the nature of consciousness? This is, this is amazing guys. This is, this question is amazing. So uh, let's ask what is the response? Let's see. The nature of consciousness is a deeply complex and widely debated topic in philosophy, psychology. Okay. Ha. Huh. Like this is quite complex topic that uh, human human is actually uh, trying to understand what is the consciousness. So, uh, like it has some definition. It has given actually you know a very uh, typical textbook question. So I I'll be asking it uh, that uh, what is your views? What is your views on it? So let's see. As uh, AI developed by OpenAI, I don't have a personal which Okay, okay, okay. So it is telling that it doesn't have uh, the uh, its own personal uh, views. So it's okay. Uh, let's move on the another question. So let's see this question. Can artificial intelligence surpass the human intelligence? So this, this question is quite famous or in fables, you can say, because uh, if it will happen, maybe it will happen in my opinion, then it will be a danger for the human beings. So uh, let's see from the chat GPT. It is a complex and multifaceted topic. Okay. So it is actually giving you a, a like, a, you know, a comparison between these things. So it is uh, giving the AI limitation in the emotion, understanding and all. Uh, but okay, uh, it has given a lot of things. You know, like I have used, I am using chat GPT continuously and I'm, I'm uh, like, uh, I'm seeing that it's, uh, this clarity is improved now and it is more faster than the previous chat GPT. Okay, uh, let's ask uh, this mathematical problem because mathematical problem is important to us that actually shows the reasoning capability okay because these uh, these can be uh, actually uh, generated by the text input that uh, has been given but for the uh, maths uh, it have to uh, do some calculations so let's see so it actually subtract the seven from the both of the sides 
and actually yes it have got the answer six so it is it is quite good it is quite good i appreciate that but it can also uh, do uh, more complex maths so let's see further so okay is there any other question okay no so let's ask one more question um okay so this is the question like what strategies can be employed to maintain a healthy work life balance so uh, let's see because many of the people work and their life is unbalanced so we actually always try to balance it so let's see what is the views of chat gpt or oh, actually what it is generating it has not their own personal views it is actually generating the text so that's why it is not harmful today okay it if in the future it will have some type of the intelligence and it will be able to generate something then that will be alarming thing because it will be able to think independently okay fine so you can see here a lot of things now uh, now we will be telling that uh, right in that table okay and it will be beautifully write it in the table and that's 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 amazing guys that's amazing you can see here uh, it is quite uh, writing it very crystal clear so one thing is uh, this all was amazing guys you can use it and you can just wait for some more time so that uh, it will be uh, rolling down um, in your chat gpt also so one thing that i felt bad about it because uh, like it has some limitation of the chats maybe 10 or uh, 20 chats are there so like uh, you you will be not able to upload uh, more files so uh, let's uh, upload uh, let's upload a image okay um let's see this what this image is telling okay so let's see that how it is interpreting the images and uh, actually it is quite good at interpreting the image uh and you know on a mobile phone you can actually get uh, click a selfie of yourself and ask the question that uh, what the emotion i am feeling from the face so it can actually show okay so this is the thing they have uh, they, uh, like chat gpt has tell about it so gpt vision is quite good and i find it very interesting okay fine so this was all it about the gpt 4 and it is amazing guys i i am really impressed from it and uh, you have seen the launch like you can see uh, the video of the launch uh, uh, like uh, it will be in the i button okay so click there and uh, go and watch after watching this video okay so now let's see the trick of uh, the chat gpt you know like when you will be going when you will go and uh, just write in the chat gpt that uh, uh, i am just doing something um i am just uh, okay and i am just uh, writing it what is machine learning okay what is machine learning and why people need to study that let's see what it will do and how it will generate you can see here like it is generating okay that's good so uh, i am just uh, giving a prompt it it in it okay you can see here uh, i am just uh, going to paste a prompt and uh, this is actually a pre built prompt so when i will write the same question okay i am just uh, going to ask what is machine learning and why people will need to to learn it okay and let's see you can see here it can uh, it is actually adding the emojis it is actually giving the answers in the uh, points sub points so that is that is amazing so uh, one thing uh, you have to do that uh, i am just going to give you the prompt first go and like uh, write your any opinion about chat gpt o uh, that uh, what you expected and uh, uh, what you got and what how you are feeling about chat gpt o and what is your thinking about its future and uh, the the prompt will be in the description just go and copy it okay 
So uh, it will be in the description. Just go and copy it and paste it here. Okay. So that is uh, that is it. And you can see here that you have reached the your GPT 4.0 limit. So this limit is bad. Uh, okay, guys. So thank you so much. Uh, if you like this video, then please uh, hit the like button and subscribe this channel. Thank you so much. Meet you in the next video.